Nicole's got her removal geeks, and here I am at the Jola yeah. booth checking yeah, out the Sailfish Show West. But actually, what's even more cool, because I'm sure you guys have seen some videos on Sailfish already, is this kind of cool labs table. So there's a bunch of stuff going on here. Here's a wireless charging back cover, so you kind of see how you can uh, do that yourself. There's the phone wireless charging right over there. So there's a whole bunch of cool stuff going on over here, and I was actually just going to be filming these. Look, look, there's one with a touch LED on the back. This one has a 3D printed uh, physical keyboard. So they, these guys are actually making this 3D printing stuff. Um, like this case, you can go to their site and you can download it and put it back, put it on yourself. So what's cool about the hardware is it kind of has this front panel and then you, you can kind of do what you want with the back panel. So um, if you haven't had a chance to check out Sailfish OS, uh, it's I loved Mego, so I'm always kind of interested to see what the new iterations look like. So you pull up from the bottom to go to the notifications. If you go from the side, it brings you to the main OS. You scroll up for the apps. So the apps are actually uh, Android applications, and it's actually running on the Myriad Dalvik layer. So you can run, basically, I think it's Android 4.2 um, series apps, and then you can kind of move forward from there. Let's just go into the settings and take a look around back there. So you can see that the it's very clean, the setup at the back bigger volume. I like that. I like that choice of, U of UI iteration right there. Um, to go into the system, nice and clean. It's running a Snapdragon 400 processor. The end price is actually uh, $399 with no subsidies. But what else is cool at this table? If you noticed, this is a Samsung Galaxy handset, and this is actually running Jola. So there we are in the notifications. We can just go back there. Let's just head back. Oh, wait. Sorry down. Oh, wait. What's going on? Ah, wasn't quite firm enough there no, to slide in yeah. for to go back. But what's neat is, is that you can actually control everything from these little tiles that's playing there. Oh, too lightly. There we go. You hear that? That's a little too loud here, but it's actually playing. If you can feel the vibrations in your hand, you know it's absolutely working. So Sailfish is actually planning on going to Android devices later this year because these guys just want to spread the Sailfish love, nice open source. If you guys are following, I've been following this uh, very closely since Mego. Actually, I've been following this since Mimo, <laughs> quite a long time. So it's nice to see like that the, the open source customization is kind of still around here where you can print your own back covers. Uh, so like, the 3D printing love in the community is still very similar to what we kind of felt with when you're following it through Migo, if you have been, maybe it was just me. So anyways, Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks, taking a look at kind of what's here on the labs table at the Jola booth at MWC. Oh, look at that. Love it. Love it. <laughs>